one years old. Cobb commissioners today postponed a vote on whether to ask voters to approve a new special 1% sales tax. This after residents peppered them with concerns and questions about the SPLOST proposal. Channel 2's Ross Cavett is live in Cobb County where leaders met for lunch of, for much of the day trying to make the project more attractive to voters. Yeah, the expected vote today did not happen. County commissioners are very aware in an economy like this, asking voters to essentially raise their own taxes may not fly. When it comes to the current SPLOST plans, it seems no one is completely happy. It's too large for too long a period. We're taxed on taxes. I have lost complete trust in my county government. The currently proposed SPLOST is much bigger than we need. That last comment came from a county commissioner. Helen Gorham says the original six-year proposal was way too big, and the trimmed-down five-year SPLOST request is still too top-heavy for voters to support. The project list contains too many elective, non-essential wants, along with a sizable list of critical needs. Cobb voters have approved SPLOSTs dating back to the mid-80s, often for big-ticket projects. The big new courthouse is one. This SPLOST, though, is built as a taking-care-of-business type of thing, maintaining roads, bridges, and buildings in the county. But over and over, commissioners were reminded times they've been a-changing. This vote will be like no other. The revised project list still contains tens of millions of dollars for projects that should not be pursued at the time when citizens of this county are suffering through the worst and the most persistent bout of unemployment since the Great Depression. So what's next? The county commissioners and the mayors of all six cities and all their staff got together much of the day today trying to pare down that SPLOST request. There may be another vote on it next week. Live in Cobb County, Ross Cavett, Channel 2 Action News. Now more details. Previous SPLOST in Cobb County have gone toward big ticket items like a new courthouse, a county jail, and the new transportation management center in Marietta. The current SPLOST expires at the end of next year. And voters need to approve a new SPLOST during the March election to have it continue in 2012.